What's up, what is it? Crypto Muscle. Coming to you with another YouTube video. Here we are, international now. Worldwide, thank you. This is where it's at. Crypto Muscle and the Crypto Muscle Network. Coming to you with another YouTube video. Uh, this is going to be kind of a overall update on some platforms today uh, that I wanted to cover. It's going to be several platforms just because things were happening, you know, over the last few hours. Some good, some bad, and uh, some thought to be bad, and then it which turns out to be okay, and things like that. So um, I'm just going to just give it to you, uh, you know, what happened here, all right? So first, let's talk about 101 Moneymaker, all right? So it was thought that these guys were gone because it was kind of unannounced that it wasn't working, right? So there was a little bit of a mini panic, overreaction, and... Um, they were doing some adjustments on the site, whatever maintenance uh, could have been, uh, you know, an up, updating it in some sort of way. And they went offline for a moment and uh, they were back on. So everything's good. OK, so everybody thought there was a little, little bit of a mini panic. And so one on one moneymaker is still here. So you make one percent per day for 101 days. All right. And so uh, it's been going on now for 101, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, it's been going on for some time now. Uh, I've been in it since the very, very beginning as I bring to you all kinds of different opportunities. I have 6,200 staked in this thing. I have a 440 balance right now. So I'm gonna go pull this out. All right, we're gonna see if everything is working as they say they're working, right? Uh, $5.05, won't be able to touch that because you need a $20 minimum, so. I have a 434 pullout right now. That's I'm um, el eligible for here. Takes one to four days to complete. Usually I get it the same day. Oops. All right, keep changing. I know sometimes uh, you just keep, you know, put it all in. It, it doesn't accept it, but you just have them keep the change and it's all good. And I love the fact that you need an authenticator to get in. I love the fact that you need an authenticator to do a withdrawal. That way, if a barrier just happens to come through, oh, too bad, you need an authenticator still to withdraw it. And then either way, they still can't get your money out, you know, so that's a good thing. So a request has been successful. Uh, it usually pays out, like, within the same day. So um, I think there was only one time where it took, like, actually, it took the full four days for whatever reason, but it's all good. Uh, I had to jump into it, make an investment. Pretty simple, right? You need at least a hundred and one dollar minimum. So none of those pissant twenty-five dollar or fifty dollar guys. And then you're gonna say, "Oh, how come you can't just have a lower minimum? How about how come you just can't raise more money?" You know, um, they don't need bullshit people in this platform. So there's BUSD, TRC20, BP20, ERC20, all stable dollars you can put in. If you hit that reinvest button, you're going to be locked into this auto compound until uh, the end of your tenure. That's a long time, 101 days. I wouldn't want to do that. So, simple as that. Make 1% a day for 101 days. And uh, it's still holding its own out there right now. One on one money maker. So, check that out. All right. So, a little bit of a mini scare, but everything's all right. Let's take a look over at. Uh, Let's see here, left coins, all right? So there was kind of a little bit of a mini scare on left coins, all right? Uh, let me see here. So I just did left coins the other day. I just did it on Friday, and I got paid out Friday, all right? And uh, now it's Sunday morning. And uh, a little bit of a mini scare here too because... Um, I don't know, there's a little bit of conversions going on in the back office in terms of uh, BUSD and USDT and all that uh, because I think they're getting rid of one of them. <laughs> so uh, let me see here. If I could figure that out. Um, no, I can't figure out what they're trying to get rid of. <laughs> but they're trying to get rid of one of those things. And uh, that's why they took one or over the other. I think they're trying to get rid of the BUSD if you have any. Alright, if you have any BUSD, 
I think they were trying to get rid of that and put it into your tether for you. you know, just to take care of that for you. So a little bit of a mini scare because supposedly they were, they you know thought it wasn't working and all that, but it's working. All right, it's working. And so, matter of fact, I'm just going to just pull out that 6775 since it's there, and then we're going to really see if it's really working, and then that way we could put this baby to rest in a good way that there's no issues. All right, so withdraw successful. And uh, we clean that house. And we'll see how this looks. We can always come back in a few minutes if you like. But yeah, I, I covered this on Friday. Left Coins is a, is a pre pretty good platform, right? Uh, you can make up to 4.7% daily, right? And it's in the form of these sort of, uh, I guess you could say they're like servers or my other servers. Right, pick a server. All right, and it's all based on the size of a deposit you want to put in is the size of the server. So this one right here is a twenty-five dollar server. All right, if you go to the next one, it's a fifty dollar server. If you go to this one right here, it's a five hundred dollar server. You know, and if, if you go to uh, this one right here, it says a hundred, right? But it's a thousand, uh, ten thousand dollars, even though it says X one hundred. So, you know, you pick the one that you feel suits you, and then you, you know, make a deposit and you go in, and you will make a certain rate per day, just depending on which server you pick. The bigger the server, the higher profit rate you get per day. All right, so let's look at operations. Let's see if that's still pending. Uh, it says sixty-seven something. Shows the transaction ID that it's paid out so give me one sec and there it is so it did pay out so no issues all right you can see there 1757 was the time uh let's see here what the time was that it was the same time so that to me qualifies as instant so you know what that means busting on my pants when i mean instant i mean instant busting on my pants right there for you the proof that left coins is still working because people who uh, had a little mini panic as well. It's like a mini panic Sunday, all right, with uh, a couple of these platforms here, you know, and it's like, come on, all right, relax. It's like, shit. <laughs> all right, so that's proof right there that it's working. It's fine. And so uh, 2950, I can't get out because uh, the size of these are small. Can I even get sold out? No, so I can't even get sold out. Can I get Bitcoin? I can't even get Bitcoin. I can't get Litecoin. I can't get... Yeah, those are the three I can't get. But all together, they add up to like $29. I can't get it out. Unless there's a... Like a... What do you call those things? Uh, exchangers? If they have one of those things, shit, I'll be on that. But yeah, so left coins is working. Alright, one-on-one money is working. So we're good. Now, let's see here. What else is there? Oh, let's go talk about uh, 2020 fund. Yeah, 2020 fund. Let's see if it's still loaded. Am I still loaded? All right, so I have a $5,000 deposit in this thing. Um, and it's, it's ran a, about a week now, right? Maybe slightly longer because I, I was the first uh, to put out. No, I think I might be in second. I might have been second. Uh, they put out a 2020 20 fun video, and um, what happened was with this one, there was a little bit of a mini scare as well, all right? So a little bit of a mini scare. So let's take a look at that here. Uh, let's see here. So they had to change servers and hosting, so they apologized for the issues, and this is what you need to get back going. You got to re-register with the link. Open the deposit for the same amount you went in before. And for each deposit you previously made, you will need to send proof of your transaction hash ID. And then they will manually get you back on. But if you don't have that proof, then too bad, so sad. It's easy. All you got to do is pull it out your wallet. If you have your Exodus wallet, pull that transaction, your Tron link, your whatever. All right? 
you can easily get that transaction ID if you really want to, you know, not fake the funk and be a dumbass and just be your, you know, true. So they had to change it. It used to be .com. Now it's .net here. 202020fund.net is the new domain, all right? They had to change that uh, instead of .com, all right? So that's how, you know, that's what happened there. And they'll backdate payments or add manual bonus for each some account. So whatever they want to do is fine with me. It's only ran a week, so it's not like it's ran for months and all of a sudden, oh, shit, it's gone and whatever. Uh, they had to make this change, so they did it. <laughs> all right, it's all good. A little mini scare, all right? Three mini scares. All right, and then... Now, do you want to be scared now? Do you want to be scared? All right. Let's talk about, uh, let's see here. Where is it at? I got to find it. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Uh, damn, where is it at? Oh, there it is. Here it is. So this one right here, globalaid.club, all right. This one, all right. Sorry to say, the, the contract got drained, all right? Uh, a lot of activity gone on overnight, and uh, the platform got drained, or the contract got drained. Well, uh, it's, you know, I mean, it. <laughs> am I surprised? No. That's why I didn't go, you know, balls deep in this thing. I only threw in 50 bucks, and if I was able to get something out of this, then i get something out of this. If not, then hey... <laughs> 50 bucks, you know, what, no, you know, not a big deal. You know, now I'm looking at this, or this reminds me of, um, if you guys recall, there's a Tron, uh, DAP that was very similar to this called Income Matrix. Now, there, it, without the matrix part of it, there's something about this that just reminds me of that because they also provided products like this stuff here, and, and, uh, the only thing they had was just one, I guess, linear line, right? Instead of all these different matrices and all that attached to it. No, that's not. not I'm sorry, not Inca Matrix. Uh, tur uh, TRX Turbo. That's what it was called. And uh, they had it. There, there was a contract called TRX Turbo. And there's a douchebag out there, still out there in this space, called. His name is uh, Andy Cole Queen or Cole Quinn, right? What a dumbass Brit douchebag, right? So this is Andy Cole Quinn dude ran this. Turbo TRX, right? And of course, he's the front guy. He's the guy that ran it. So obviously, what's going to happen? If you go in under him, he's going to get everything, right? So, you know, he ran something like this, you know, and had all these different products. He had different matrices and all that stuff as well. You got to buy, the, you know, a package to level up and all that stuff. So that's what he did. And then as that one was kind of slowing down, he came out with twin turbo TRX. All right, and then that trash kind of uh, went by the wayside. And then him, he partnered up with another douchebag in this space named Crypto Miguel. So Andy Colquin, a little Brit dumbass, partnered up with Crypto Miguel. And I didn't know it until after the fact, but I joined in on a project called, um, what is the name of that? It was a smart contract. Uh, let's see. Do I even have it here still? Oh, G Meta. That's what it was. It was called G Meta. Uh, I don't know if it's still here. G Meta. All right. And uh, I don't even know if it's still here. I'm trying to see if it's if it's here. At least I can show you guys what that is. Give me one sec. Uh, here it is right here, gmeta.1, all right? So he's been running this thing. Uh, it's about a year on this pre-launch now. And, um, yeah, see this pre, or pre-sale, not pre-launch, pre-sale. All right, this thing's been on pre-sale for like a year, all right? And um, he literally took the summer off, all right? Because he used to be, he was doing like live calls, almost daily right and they kind of slow down to like once a week and then it got to the point where he took literally took the summer off right and he said oh, i'll be back in september right so he came back in september 
making it sound like he's going to be back again to do his weekly calls, and he only came out once. <laughs> and then after that, maybe one other time, but I'm, I'll, I'll have to verify that one. And so it uh, looks like he did a little bit of, of work on this side a little bit. Okay, I'll give that to him. But yeah, same old bullshit. It's been stuck in like round four or whatever of this pre-sale for the longest time, for like a year. And people keep asking, hey, when's this thing going to, uh, let me see if they'll let me uh, see the inside here. I'm not trying to register. Yeah, still the same bonus perks and all that stuff. And so, um, yeah, this is bullshit. This thing, like I said, the pre-sale has been going on for a year. It's been stuck in round four because there's no interest, right? And they said that they're not going to launch until they complete all five rounds of, of the pre-sale. And it's like, um, okay, if you say so, because like it's been stuck in the same round for the for like a year now. And uh, how are you going to attract people when they're not really putting this shit out there? But yeah, so this G-Meta bullshit is a continuation of bullshit from that dumbass Brit Andy Colquinn. And he partnered up with his little bullshit buddy, Crypto Miguel, who's kind of just disappeared now. And so that's what that Global A reminds me of, is that bullshit uh, Turbo TRX deal here. It looks just like it, except... It had different colors and and offered similar products and stuff like that. But yeah, so am I um, surprised that this the and well that one used TRX though. This one used B and B. Uh, am I surprised though that this thing drained now? Because I don't even know if it was even audited or anything like that. I don't even know if it was the case. Let's take a look at the contract. See what it's looking like. Um. Yeah, there's only like. <laughs> 45 cents left in this contract so yeah it's definitely and they're having all these zoom calls and meetings and stuff talking about how they're going to raise the price to like a hundred dollars and do all this bullshit stuff they're not going to do nothing man this shit's dead if they even did come back with a new contract i would be ooh, i would be super cautious about even consider joining that thing i say forget about it all right because you're asking to get drained once again in some other shape or form so yeah so screw that shit uh this shit's done and any other thing that comes out of global aid you should avoid it all right so yeah that's what happened with that one so yeah you could be scared of that one now, now all these other mini scares you had this morning is it's it's all good but this one you can be scared of all right here's another one you could be scared of uh let's see here where is it at it's it's right here too with it i'm gonna I wanna. I'm sad though. I'm sad. You know why? Because you know it has to involve you know my favorite, my, one of my favorite girls here, man. Uh, where is that? There she is, right here, Miss Trinity, Miss Freckle, Miss Freckles here, Trinity. All right. So we all know that Sunday is the day today that is supposed to be here and pay, and um, it was quiet on Saturday, right? Literally no admin chat, nobody talking Saturday except for the, you know, the community talking. So everybody thought the admin disappeared. And then come around this morning, admin was like, wow, um, all this chatter going on, I'm going to lock, you know, since you guys are like fudding everything, I'm going to lock the chat. And um, this is what's going to happen. It's going to pay tonight, 8 p.m., UTC time. You know what that is? That's about eight hours from the time of, or from the West Coast time of the United States. So, am I holding my breath that this thing's going to pay? No. It's pulling, a, to me, it's pulling what Cloudfy did, right? Where they said, oh, we're going to change to once a week on Sundays. And uh, they did the same sort of shit. And am I expecting it to pay? No, nah, it's not going to pay. This shit is done too, all right? They just dragged it out for a week or so longer just to kind of, I don't know, string you along and just say, hey, you know, we're trying to work this thing out for Sunday. But this one didn't have the clout like Cloudfy. So I don't think a lot of new money went into it during the past week because, you know, it didn't have that clout. That was the thing missing with Trinity. As I said in my video when they first made that announcement about this change is that I just think that Trinity... Could have been something, 
it just wasn't all right it didn't have that it factor for whatever reason i liked it i thought it was cool and a lot of people liked it but there wasn't enough of us people liking it for it to go crazy for it to continue running business and that's why they decided to shift direction shift their plans and therefore shift it to the end and that's why trinity is over and that's what i'm saying so global aid's over and if you want to be scared too double shot scared then okay you can be scared that trinity's over as well and you know what else is scary too all right this is what's scary all right let's go over to uh this one right here all right what is going on with this thing all right this thing is scary too because they said they were going to have something on the other side all right on uh saturday and yet what is today what is today oh today is sunday <laughs> okay so so again they have not followed through what they say they're following they're going to follow through if they're going to say something and mean it then do it right don't just say oh we're going to come back on saturday and we'll talk about what happened because it's already passed so all you dumb idiots out there that sat there and said, oh, we trust Jensen because he always follows through with what he says. Uh, well, that's twice now, maybe even three times that he hasn't followed through with what he said he's going to do because he said he's going to be back October 1st, and he wasn't. And then he said, give him a couple days, he'll be back. And then it happened. And he said he's going to start withdrawals. didn't happen. He said, all right, we're gonna, we got some... Uh, Issues going on in the back office. We're going to be back Saturday to cover it. Still didn't happen. So everybody's kind of like in limbo right now on this stuff. And I, I just find it funny as hell. But I'm going to save it for Death Watch on some some uh, information I want to share in terms of, uh, you know, the trading that they were talking about. All right. It's going to be fun because I don't want to break it down here because... This is not a Death Watch video, all right? This is just kind of giving you guys an overall update of what's going on out there that I've been seeing. Oh, <laughs> I guess I'll throw this out there, too. Uh, Invisible, you know, has talked about, uh, you know, refunds and things like that. And I guess they issued it out to 50 people. And now they locked a the chat because they said that they're not going to open the chat until they pay out the next set of people and they said the next set should be about 100 people this time and then once they do that they'll open the chat back up in order to do that and then after that they're going to close the chat so i don't know this is bullshit stuff all right not believing it all right i want to see proof that people are getting it and the refund is only for the ones that didn't break even all right not not if you didn't get your profit and all that all right don't be greedy just the ones that did not get you know, wasn't able to break even, all right? So, I think that's about everything. But the, the Vortec, I'm saving for Death Watch is because I'm waiting for that update to come because I want to show you how much of a bullshitter that this, this charade is going right now you know, of, of Jensen going to the charades and, and bullshitting, all right? It, it's just funny, and I'm going to point it out to you. And it's just so in plain sight, all right? All right, and and, um, and if that went right by you guys, then you guys got to get out of crypto. You guys are a bunch of garbage if that just happens to just go right by you without even flinching eyes. Like, oh, hello, did you guys catch that? All right, and it just, he just, and, it, and all I got to say, it just happened over this past week. All right, so we're going to leave it at that. But I just wanted to give you guys an update on everything that's going on. This is not a death watch. Uh, video per se, but just a, uh, just an update on the platforms that are going on, uh, a little bit of mini scares, and then stuff to be scared of that exited, and then stuff to, to come that's going to exit. Yeah, we'll call it that, all right? So, uh, let's see, we covered with three platforms. Man, it could have been two, 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 two platforms, but I had to cover three in the beginning, and then two bad ones that went away, and then two that are about to go away. Yeah. And that's everything you need to know. Comment down below. Let me know what you think. I got links down below in the description. Uh, subscribe to everything I got. And other than that, um, yeah, let me know what you think. And I will see you in the next one.